Hey, good morning. It's Pete again. Uh, another video with the Junsun uh, stereo in my Ram 1500. I have a 2016 Ram 1500 crew cab. I put the Junsun stereo in. Um, it's been fantastic with the exception of the temperature display for the air conditioning. So it will not show me the temperature. I've been waiting for tech support from Junsun and they finally got back to me and they let me know what I have to do. And what I have to do is uh, pop the stereo unit out put my original stereo back in and go through some settings changes to change the display to metric and then put the Johnson stereo back in. So we're going to do this and see if it helps. Um, this is the Johnson head unit I have in the Ram 1500. I do have my original uh, Uconnect stereo here. So I'm going to put the harness, uh, connect the harness back uh, to the Ram stereo, go through the instructions that they gave me and then put this unit back in and we'll see what happens. Uh, to get the unit out, very simple. Up at the top, I took this little rubber mat off the, out of here. And when that rubber mat comes out, there's two T20 screws in there. They're torque screws. And then down below, uh, this little tray pops out from underneath here. That reveals two 7 millimeter metric sockets and then the plastic tray at the bottom in front of the cigarette lighter you'll see one more seven millimeter uh, bolt right there so I'm gonna take those out uh, I have to take the bottom out because I need to pop this out a little bit to get the clearance for the front piece uh, this piece here pops out as one so I'm gonna take this out pop it back take the seven millimeters out and I'll be able to pop this out and then we'll look at what is next So before I take this out, I want to show what's happening with the stereo. Um, I am ready to take it out, but I wanted to show what the display is. So on the Johnson head unit, if I go into the home and then go to car info, I can go to air set. And instead of having the temperature on here right now, even when I go to auto, um, it switches to auto, but it only says low and if I hit the up button here I can hear this the climate control is changing so it is changing temperature but it's not showing me the temperature if I keep hitting it now it goes to high right so now it's at the highest range of the temperature and it does change the temperature um, it changes the temperature but it will not show me no matter what uh, even when I adjust there, you can see it pops up high and low. No temperature setting. So that's what we're trying to fix. I want to see what the temperature setting is at. So we'll see if this fix really works. I've removed the T20 screws from the top. I've removed the 7 millimeter bolts from the bottom. Now I can pop this bottom unit up and out of the way and pull this out and get that other radio back in there for a second and see if I can fix the, by changing the display to metric. All right, so I've got uh, the stereo popped out and I've got the stock stereo back in. So let's look at what Johnson says I have to do. So this is uh, the head unit is popped forward and I, you can see I have the bottom here popped up and out so I can get this unit out. This is the stock stereo. I simply reconnected the main harness to the back. So I'm gonna go into the apps on the old Uconnect stereo. I'm gonna click on settings. I'm gonna click on display. And then I'm gonna scroll down until I see units. And you can see it's set to US. They tell me I need to change that to metric. And now I'll go back out of settings, go back out of display. Now I'm gonna pop the stereo out and I'm gonna reconnect the Johnson head unit and I'm gonna see if it makes any changes. We'll see what happens next. Well, I'll be damned, it actually works. So I popped my Johnson unit back in after changing uh, the stock stereo to metric. And um, when I turned on the car info and in the air set, I got a temperature reading, albeit in metric, but I'll show you how I fixed that as well. So let's switch. 
So the head unit's on. I'm going to go back into car info and air set. And look at that, 68 degrees. I can go up and modify my auto setting now. This is what I needed before, right? Now I can actually change that setting. So now the auto is coming on because I changed the temperature up. And you can see it says it's set for 75. That's set for 68. I can adjust that as needed. Um, I'll bump this one up. I'll set it to 71. And I'll bump this one down to 71 as well. So I've got the setting the same for both. So to change the setting from Celsius to Fahrenheit, oh, sorry, I still haven't popped this back in, so it's moving around a little bit. But I went to settings, and then I went to car settings, and from there into the factory settings. With this unit, it's six zeros, and that gets me into factory settings. I went into can-related settings. This is for the CAN bus, and I went down and found temperature unit, and it was set to Celsius. I clicked on that, changed it to Fahrenheit, and sure enough, after backing out of the screens, I went back in to the car info and then the air set app, and now I have Fahrenheit. So this does work, and I am gonna put this in my review of the Jensen Stereo. Their tech support has been fantastic. Um, there's a Jensen, uh, um, U.S. email address that I've been corresponding with. They're great, and they've able they've been able to fix the couple issues I had. So now I have 100% confidence, and I'm very happy in the system. I'm going to button everything back up, and uh, that'll be the end. I need to get everything popped back in place and get my uh, torque screws and my bolts back in. So if you're uh, if you've installed this Johnson unit in your Ram stereo uh, in your Ram pickup truck, and you're not getting the temperature display on the stereo, uh, that is the fix pop the old radio back in all you have to do is plug the main harness in turn the car on let it fire up it's going to give you a couple of errors uh, because the gps isn't connected and the bluetooth isn't connected you can ignore those go into settings make that display change uh, to metric and then uh, take it back out reconnect your Johnson stereo and you should be back in business thanks for watching i'm pete